Hi, my name is Lisa Heath. I'm from Lloydminster, Alberta. Several years ago, I was praying. Uh, the Holy Spirit began to show me um, the way that I should pray, and it was for Saskatoon and Meadow Lake, Wainwright, Vermilion, Vagerville, all the surrounding little communities and cities and towns that were um, in our region. And um, I just kept praying and um, um, just wondering, you know, where the Lord was leading me in this, but I was just blessing the churches, blessing the pastors and the staff, and especially the worship teams and worship leaders. And uh, one day I was out in my backyard. I was actually raking leaves in March, and I was setting piles of leaves on fire to get rid of them. And the Holy Spirit stopped me and he said, Lisa, look at these piles of leaves here. He said, this is what I'm going to do in the nation of Canada. I am going to set cities on fire, just like these burning piles of leaves are burning. And I said, God, if this is what you're going to do in the nation of Canada, I want to be part of it. Use me any way you can, God. I want to be part of this. And he said, I'm going to release to you some strategies. It's worship, prayer, and unity. And these things are going to be used for my glory. It's going to set my cities on fire for my glory. And um, I, we began to do worship and prayer nights in our city. And um, we would go for long extended periods of time, 27 hours, 12 hours, and, and um, just gathering people from these communities that I had been praying for for so many years. And um, God led me to phone Faith Alive and Val Keen got on the phone with me. And I began to share my vision with her, how I felt that the Lord had given us these strategies for worship, prayer, and unity. And she said, Lisa, I think you need to come to Saskatoon. You need to be part of Prairie Fire Unite. And so I brought my family um, for the last few years, and we have experienced an amazing, tangible presence of the Holy Spirit every time we come, and the unity that is building in the Spirit. Even this morning, I just arrived today and um, just absolutely felt waves of revival in this place, waves of revival in the people even. And uh, God is doing something so powerful in our nation, and it is built on unity. It is built on getting together and loving Him first. You know, the Word of God says that we are to love the Lord our God with all our heart and soul and mind and love our neighbor as ourselves. And it has to be in that order. And I really feel that um, there's a special anointing when we get together because number one, we're just loving on Him. And number two, we're loving each other. I was greeted so warmly today. It was like they were greeting their sister. And I've seen so many familiar faces. And it's like truly coming home when we come into, um, into this place. And truly, we have made brothers and sisters in Christ. And that's what it's all about. And this is what revival is looking like. And so I just want to honor and thank the leadership and the pastors that have seen God's heart for this. Um, it is definitely the oil that's being poured out and the oil is poured out on the headship and then the beard and then the robes and it just flows down. That's Psalm 133.3 and it's just beautiful. It's beautiful to be part of it. Thank you.